I'm checking out Nix OS, the Linux distribution built on the Nix package manager that nails reproducible declarative atomic system configurations. Stick around and you'll know if it's worth switching to, who it's designed for, and what makes it so powerful compared to traditional Linux. Nix OS is built for developers, power users, DevOps teams, anyone tired of works on my machine chaos. You write your whole system in one file, packages, services, even kernel options, and apply it all at once. No piecemeal installs, no hidden dependencies. Everything is declarative and reproducible. What makes it unique? Every change creates a new generation. Think atomic updates and rollbacks baked into your boot menu. Mess something up, reboot into the previous config in seconds. And because it builds packages in isolation with hashed paths, you avoid conflicts and dependency hell entirely. New in NixOS 2505 Warbler, over 7,800 fresh packages, updates to 28,000 more, GNOME 48, Linux kernel 6.12, LLVM 19, and GCC 14, all with seven months of support. The strengths, rock-solid reliability, full rollback control, true reproducibility, and massive package availability. Need dev, CI, Docker, cloud images? One tool does it all declaratively. But the flip side? There's a steep learning curve. Mastering Nix expressions takes effort and it really rewards a functional mindset. Also, if you're expecting the simplicity of Ubuntu or Fedora, get ready to edit config.nix, rebuild, understand flakes. It's powerful, but it isn't plug and play. Here's my take. If you care about reproducible setups, reliable dev environments, seamless rollbacks, and you don't mind learning a declarative system, NixOS is awesome. Use it in VMs or servers if you want stable, confidence-inspiring systems. But if you just want a desktop that just works with minimal config, something like Fedora might be a smoother ride. In short, NixOS gives you a rock-solid, reproducible Linux platform that's insanely powerful. If you're ready for the mindset shift, it's totally worth it.